Villa that Diana's first picture, Meghan Markle and Harry likely planning special cause. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will likely introduce to the world their daughter with pictures shared to benefit a cause close to their heart, according to an expert. Meghan and Prince Harry have yet to publicly share a picture of their daughter Lilibet Lily Diana. As they are no longer full-time members of the royal family, there is no pressure on the Duke and Duchess to do it anytime soon. Royal biographer Omid Scobie said on Sunday, following the Sussex's announcement of the birth of their daughter, Meghan and Harry will not be sharing a photo at this time. While there is no clue as to when they will publish photographs of Lily, one royal commentator believes this move will be made in support to one or more organizations close to the Duke and Duchess heart. Royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams told Express.co.uk, I think it very likely that Harry and Meghan will release a photo or photos of Lily to the world's press in a way which will benefit one or more of the charitable causes they espouse. Their weeks of leave is certain to exclude certain charitable activities if they see a chance to promote causes they support. This move would be in line with decisions made in the past by Meghan and Harry. A note published alongside the statement informing the public of the birth of Lily on Archyule.com urged people inquiring on sending gifts to instead support or learn more about organizations working for women and girls backed by the Duke and Duchess. The note named Girls Incorporated, Harvest Home, Kempf and Monomahila Foundation. Prince Harry and Meghan also linked their son Archie Harrison's birthday to charitable initiatives. On May 6, 2020, when Archie turned one, Save the Children released a video on its Instagram page. The clip, filmed by Prince Harry, showed Archie sitting on Meghan's lap as she read her the children's book Duck, Rabbit. This video was released as part of the Save with Stories campaign, aiming to support children in need during the pandemic. Princess Anne, the patron and president of Save the Children, was also filmed reading a children's book to end the charity's initiative. On Archie's second birthday, Meghan and Harry shared a call to action to support vaccine equity. The Sussexes, who were the campaign chairs of Global Citizens Vax Live, the concert to reunite the world, said to be grateful for the support and warmth showed them by many over the past two years before inviting people who wished to donate to a cause to Mark Archie's big day to support the efforts to vaccine everyone across the globe. They said, we will not be able to truly recover until everyone, everywhere, has equal access to the vaccine. And with that intention, we are inviting you to contribute whatever you can, if you have the means to do so, to bring vaccines to families in the world's most vulnerable places. They added, we cannot think of a more resonant way to honor our son's birthday. If we all show up, with compassion for those we both know and don't know, we can have a profound impact. Even a small contribution can have a ripple effect. Upon sharing this call to action, the Duke and Duchess published a new picture of their son. In it, Archie could be seen from behind holding balloons and looking up in the sky. A spokesperson for Meghan and Harry announced on June 6 that the birth of Lily had taken place two days prior. In their statement, the Sussexes informed the public the Duchess had delivered the child in the care of the staff at Santa Barbara Cottage Hospital on June 4 at 11.40 a.m. The statement also informed Lily Wade weighed 7 pounds 11 ounces at the time of birth. It went on explaining her two names pay tribute to both Queen Elizabeth II and Princess Diana. The Archule team also informed the public the Duke and Duchess are now on parental leave. 